Now the Americans, the English, the Japanese, and the Congonese are all civilizations that are in our home continent, or I guess home landmass. Uh, they're going to be around more than likely throughout this entire game, so I need to look into our relationship with them and make them happy. So if that means, you know, giving out some free churros or something like that, then that's just what we're going to have to do as Felipe. But uh, first things first, I've got to continue to deal with these dang barbarians. It's turn 55, barbarians are going crazy, this should be kind of a normal thing. But I have two warriors and a archer coming out very soon, so that's, that's good. Uh, roads have been upgraded, even though I have no roads. And uh, over the break, I chose my, my government tab. And uh, I actually am pushing, at least initially, probably just for the first few turns, um, to make sure that we go after city-state bonuses. As a peaceful nation, we want to get as many suzerain uh, alliances, I guess. I don't even know if that's the right combination of words, suzerain alliances, but it sounds good. It sounds really good, but uh, we want to get suzerain, suzerain bonuses with everybody so that that way, we, at least we'll have... We can pull in other city-states into a defensive war if we need to. Uh, there's also a, a defensive uh, policy civic that we might want to look into. That might be pretty helpful. But let's go to the next turn. We're repairing our campus because this dude, I completely forgot this is just out there in the open. Um, but it's still really worth it. Oh man, barbarians are going everywhere. It's crazy. Okay, so let's try to take you down. And then I've got to make my way up here to go after the coffee. But before I do that, I need to uh, repair this tile. You're not... Oh, yeah. Let's uh, let's do that. And then repair. Okay. You need to sit there and heal. And then Madrid is, for the most part, safe otherwise. Uh, I might as well probably go after my third city here. I can go here and grab spices, stone, citrus. Actually, Zanzibar will probably go down towards the citrus at some point. There is this location. This isn't terrible, but... Actually, this isn't bad because at least I get all of the mountains, more iron more spices, but I'm pretty sure that I can get that location whenever. Uh, if I'm going to do something with the third city, with the third city, I should forward settle Washington, theoretically. I need to find a spot now, though. I need to find some place now. I don't really see much over here. And I need to go after these barbarians. It would have been nice if I just explored a little bit further to the north, and maybe that's what I can do with this archer. Maybe that's what I can do. I'm going to come towards here. I don't need to make a choice, but I'd like to have that third guy down in the next, like, nine turns. Or that third city down in, like, nine turns. Wealth consists not uh, so how's Madrid doing? Amenity-wise, you're good. District or Housing-wise, you're also very good. Yeah, cities are at seven, seven population. I mean, that's an excellent start. I mean, we've got some really amazing tiles. I don't even know... Yeah, I guess... Yeah, you're, you're doing fine, actually. This is best-case scenario. Okay, so we're going to choose technology. I think I want to go for probably some defensive things. Oh, watermill is good for extra housing. I'm sorry, for extra food and production. It doesn't give any housing, but I feel like it should. I really feel like it should, but, you know, we'll, we'll see. And then here is uh, an aqueduct, which will be really useful in a game like this. Okay, so there's our shrine. We probably do want a shrine up because I'm sure the great, you know, the, the religion race is on. And, uh... A trader is good, but, you know, unfortunately at the moment... Oh, you know what? Did I settle in a different continent? I don't even know if I did. I was too busy, like, paying attention. It wasn't. And there's really nothing I would have done. I, I probably wouldn't have made the choice to go over here. I would be missing out on all the rices and stuff like that. On the rice bonuses. So maybe I, I should force myself to go over here. Yeah. So that at least I have... It might not be the greatest city ever. But uh, that it still would be, I think, a pretty good idea. So let's go here. Create an escort. And, uh, okay, we're in a little bit better of a position. Okay, let's also go with the shrine so we get up our religion because I'm a little worried that we're not going to get it. A little worried about that. Okay, so range attack. Let's see if we can't just kill this scout, first of all. Let's kill the scout. I need to purchase a builder, but I'm not... I don't have any money left. I make 11 gold per turn, which is pretty nice, but uh, besides that, it's not good. You're also growing pretty fast. So getting up a granary, yeah, I think it's kind of crucial right now. Let's go with a granary. That's right, because I just purchased the warrior, so it explains why I don't have much money at the moment. Okay, so you want to come after me. That is fine, because I'll just run back inside of my home and uh, attack you from there. Perfect. There's nothing to pillage yet. I need to make sure that I have Barcelona pretty safe, though. Okay, so we've created... There we go. So I'm going to come out over this way. Now, I might explore a little bit more. I don't have to settle right here right here. 
I could explore a little bit more. I mean, this might, mountain range might be pretty big. So we can get some uh, excellent adjacency bonuses. Now, campus or theater squares, which are really crucial, are going to get adjacency bonuses when next to a wonder. Kind of sucks because I'm not a big wonder builder and culture from every two adjacent uh, district tiles. Hmm. Which we built a holy site and a campus far away from each other. So, yeah. What are you doing just chilling on that? I see you just chilling right there. Okay, so let's go to Zanzibar. Obviously, four gold in the capital sounds like a good plan to me. And I'm going to do the same thing I did that scout. Good. And the city state's starting to expand down towards us, or at least bring his military down here. So that's good, helping me feel a little bit more safe. Perfect time to build the granary. I'm glad that I anticipated that. You know, right around like under two, that limit. Wait, where are you going? You going around? I love a leader who is surrounded by an oppressive military. So that is her ag hidden agenda. That's her hidden agenda. She's naturally not going to like me. Remember, England likes sieves when they have a city on their home continent. Right now, she doesn't have a sieve on my capital's continent, I guess, is a better way to put it. Uh, don't be annoying. Don't be annoying. You're going to be annoying. I already know. Well, I can do a lot of damage to this guy, so let's do that. So he's he might either try to run away, he'll back away into the copper. We'll see. We'll see what he tries. Any vision? Nope. Okay, we're safe. We'll, we're, we're safe here. You went that dumb way, warrior. I don't even know why you did that. We gotta go towards the coffee, man. And what are you gonna do? Hey, Congo, why are you unfriendly? You are, you do, you need to not be unfriendly. Where is this barbar- oh, there's another encampment right there. This guy is still up? Jeez, okay. Well, I need to focus on the coffee first. And then I need to get- Do we need another builder? It would be nice to get another builder. But I'm thinking- I'm thinking we need like a warrior or something. A swordsman would be nice. I might just need to settle this guy, pull the warrior back home, because this guy, I, he's, they're going to plunder my, sit, my, my, my campus again. They're going to plunder that thing again. Build ancient walls. I can probably boost that. Do we have access to the, we, yeah, we can, we have access to the ancient walls. Can I purchase the ancient walls? I actually can't build the ancient walls just yet. Well, then we should probably research that technology then, Hundrew. Huh, I guess. Yeah, so there we go. Four turns. That's not too bad. How's our great people search for a religion? That's a great scientist, Drew. This is a great prophet. Okay. It's going to be close. Right now, we don't really have very many points. Um, there has been... How many religions? Two of six. Dang. So normally in a game of eight, you can get five religions. In a game of ten, you only get six, so it's actually going to be a little bit harder to get up a religion in this scenario. I mean, the shrine will certainly help us. I want amenities first before I do anything else. Let's focus on amenities. You stay there. Let me double check on the management of Barcelona. See, there's no point in you go here. Work both of the rice resources. Okay. Library, water mill. It might be best to... I think I want a heavy chariot. Four turns? I mean, that's great. That's a great deal. That's a good deal. And we can just go around and start ravaging barbarian encampments. At least, at least hopefully. Hopefully. He, th th there's spearmen, which I know barbarians love spearmen. They're probably going to do quite a bit of damage to us. But um, that's a risk I'm willing to take. Now, I can go after the iron and start trading the iron. That's not bad. Or I could make these rice resources great like super amazing I think I should go after the iron to be honest okay so we, we grab that we want to get down as many theater we want a theater district pretty much everywhere and then great profit points is the next way to go let me change around my government uh, we might want to go here for now just to get us a little bit of great rider points for now unit maintenance we have to pretty much skip out on all of this. Gold from trade routes. We don't have any trade routes. Settlers, builders. Yeah, this is this is good. We want to continue to do some stuff like this. Plus two points per turn towards earning. Yeah, let's do the plus point turn thing. I don't know if I'm going to find any more city-states. Like, this is crazy. I have not found any city-states at all. I'm glad that they did not pillage my, my campus. Not yet. Knock on wood. 
Please do not pillage my campus. Okay, so what's over here? Okay, there's a ruin over here, so that's good. Jeez, this might not be... This might be a terrible spot for a city. More iron? Jeez. There are the Congo. Okay, so we probably made the right choice settling here or finding someplace over here to settle. Because it's just, just really not going to be that many, you know, good spots left. Yeah, the spots left, just there's not going to be much. Alright, so let's go after this ruin. Get a better idea. Oh, jeez. This, uh, yeah. I might need to come back. At least if I can get the access to the spices, that's something, right? And I'm still next to a, a river, technically. So that's good. Builds ancient walls. I know I can boost that. Oh, I'm going to boost iron, my, uh, iron working right now, so let's do that. Yeah, so bam, production. I like that. I got a, oh, jeez, I got a scout here. Well, I guess, thank you. I mean, I, I could have used a scout a while ago, but I guess I've already found all the sieves in this continent for the most part. Okay, so let's go barbarian hunting. We need to go barbarian hunting, like, right now. I can also start upgrading these warriors, which will do a lot more damage to barbarians. Get great general points. Um, housing. Uh, that, yeah, you know, housing is pretty important. Let's go there. Let's go there. And do we want to change this up? Yeah, I do, actually. I want great profit points. I got to, you know, I really want to get a religion. I'll change it back to writing later, but great profit points for now. Because this is going to be a race that we might not even get to. Ooh, it's going to be close. I mean, I'm generating, like, a lot, I think. 2.3 per turn. It's going to be close. Ancient walls in nine turns. Jeez, I don't know. You know, I'll probably build the trader here. Yeah, let's build the trader inside of Barcelona, since you don't have anything else to do. And, uh, and then we've got our war chariot, so we've got to take out all these encampments, settle our third city. Of course this guy's going to make it difficult on us. I can take... I mean, this encampment's not going to be that big of a deal, although he will be spawning boats. Those barbarian boats will be very... Very annoying. And let me take good care of this scout. He shouldn't be too big of a deal. Do you need the extra support? I'm going to say no. I'm actually going to go this way. I think he'll be fine. That guy's going to run away. Ancient walls in five turns, I think, is the way to go. I would like a library, but ancient walls would be a good idea since we're probably going to be dealing with barbarians for the most part in this campaign. There's just so much open space. Yeah, there's just too much open space. And then I'll be buying a, another worker inside of probably Madrid. We want to focus on Madrid, even though Barcelona has more opportunities to make a really great city, I think, with the rice resources, things like that. They both could use a builder. I might do the same thing. When, when the infrastructure gets placed down, I could probably more quickly shift, the, uh, shift those guys around. Do not mess with that. Do not mess with my wine. Oh, oh, I uh, did you... I think we should be okay. Yeah, he's gonna go away. And then I'm gonna settle there next turn. Okay, good. Holy crap. Holy crap. Alright, I'm gonna back... I'm gonna back up. We're actually gonna wait him there, actually, because... I'm gonna go full strength and then upgrade him to a swordsman. We've got backup coming, so it's not a big deal. Who needs the upgrade? You need the upgrade. Okay, that's fine. Do scouts plunder? That's going to be the next question. Also, will the city-state help us? No, he's focused on taking care of this encampment, which is a good thing, because I, I, I would rather not. Yeah, so he took care of that. Perfect. Please go away. He decided to attack my, my warrior instead of my archer. That's interesting. Ooh, is that a horseman? It is. So he probably did quite a bit of damage to my archer. Okay, good. So they did not plunder. They did not pl plunder this resource here. Ooh. Okay, so let's just heal. I think we'll be okay. Range strength versus land units. 10 combat strength when occupying a district. No, we want to go volley. Although, more defensive promotions is a very smart idea. Hmm. You're going to attack us again. I already know you. I might back up. You know, I've got this guy coming. I might not even do, need to do the upgrade right now. 
it might be a better idea to focus on... Here, let's settle this city. We're getting our extra housing. So that's good. We're next to a river. That's also very good. A builder's going to cost 150. Yeah, I think I want to wait till next turn. Uh, again, we have... We have heavy chariot that, you know, they can maybe just be distracted over here. Let's have you heal. And then ancient walls, we're going to boost engineering. Okay, cool. So we'll be able to rush through that. Yes, theater squares are very important, but let's go with the monument. I think I want a theater square next in Madrid. I think also a fourth city is kind of important too. Kind of very important here. Uh, let's send you to the front lines. I don't know where I'd send, get a fourth city at. Now, Spain, I could, you know, I'm kind of incentivized to settle far away from my my capital's continent. So I definitely need to keep that in mind. Oh, you're dead. You have, I think, done goofed. This guy needs to heal. They see the, the heavy chariot coming. That's the thing. Yeah, okay, so you're you're dead for the most part, I think. I think we have you killed. Let's leave the scout alone. Let's go after the heavy chariot. That's a, I think that's good. We'll probably have to start making aqueducts very soon. Well, especially for Madrid. Madrid has been growing in crazy ways. And and I, I do need to figure out a, a spot for a spot for wonders. I, I I need to I need to do that. I need to do wonders here. So I cannot ignore that. Okay, perfect. So you have messed up. Uh, I needed to purchase a. I need. I needed to purchase a builder last time around, but it's okay. We'll purchase that builder now, and then I'll start upgrading whenever I can. But let's do that here. Uh, you know, maybe getting him to. Bar both Barcelona and Madrid are kind of struggling housing wise, so it doesn't matter. We'll improve both tiles. It's not a, a big deal. There we go. There's our promotion. Okay, so battle cry, I think so. Even though I keep telling myself I need to go down that defensive tree a little bit more. You guys are back for some more. Okay, that is uh, that is okay if you want to do that. How much is this going to cost? 55 gold. Seems kind of like a steep price there. Yeah, I hope that we... Uh, who's, who is working on Zanzibar? It's me and England. Me and Vicky. She's trying to steal that away from me. Hmm. Okay. Um, because, or I, you know, I could start exploring with this warrior. I technically could do... Oh, well, I've got a scout that... like That's his job. His job is to explore. I think we've taken care of a lot of the barbarians over here so far. So, yeah, I'll take a, take a risk. And then, yeah, we're going to cross this way. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Well, it's okay because we... Need to probably improve the stone resource anyways. Yeah, so let's improve that. Watermill for food and production. Wheat and rice. Ooh. City must be adjacent to a river. Uh, that's This is a good building to build in Barcelona, that's for sure. But yeah, I think I said theater square next. So let's do that next. So we get an adjacency bonus by putting it here. I guess we might as well. Yeah, let's put it there. Because we need to make more culture. We need to be just, like, crazy. I know that Greece tends to do really well. I know for sure Greece is in this game. Greece tends to do pretty well culture-wise. So I need to be careful of that. Good. No uh, no new religions have been founded just yet, it looks like. Uh, I'm catching the pack, but I don't know. It is going to be close here. Because I'm catching the pack... Oh, this guy's only making 2.3. I'm making 4.6. Okay, we, we, we should be okay. I didn't know it gave us the actual values. Yeah, so that's that's good. Okay, so we're off to a pretty pretty fun start, I think. Um, I'd like a fourth city in the next one. Maybe we just have to say screw it and settle somewhere over here. This is the tundra, so there's nothing else that will be located. I mean, I guess we could forward settle Washington is the only thing I can think of. We're witnessing definitely the genocide of barbarians within this world one by one. The encampments are being destroyed. Um, there's definitely a handful that I need to destroy myself, but uh, the AIs are going to get a better hold over barbarians and expansion. I think within the next few videos, uh, speaking of expansion, I'd like to settle my fourth city for sure uh, within the next like 30 turns. So let's wait and see. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.